Wait, 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 wait. COVID-19 can affect my kidneys? Are you serious? So I gotta worry about fever, shortness of breath, cough, nausea, vomiting, social distancing, <laughs> and my kidneys? Man! Okay guys, hold up. Don't worry, I'll explain. What's up San Antonio and world? I'm Dr. Kassim Butt and I'm a kidney doctor and I'm here to break down health in a simple way. Now do me a favor, hit up that like and share button. It'll really help me out. So there is evidence out there that a certain number of COVID-19 patients do develop kidney injury. You see, the kidneys are a filter. They take blood from all over the body and clean it. Therefore, that, therefore things that happen in the body or events that happen in the body can actually injure the kidney, either directly or indirectly. Now, for more information on how kidney injury actually happens, you gotta check out my video on kidney injury. Initial evidence out of China showed that COVID-19 patients that are hospitalized, admitted to the hospital, had about a three to 9% chance of getting kidney injury. But now observational data out of New York um, estimates that ki the kidney injury rate to be about 37% in those hospitalized in the hospital for COVID. And of those 37%, 15% develop severe kidney injury requiring dialysis. So what are the possible causes? Now the cause of most of the injury is usually dehydration, which means it's usually reversible with IV fluids. Another problem with COVID-19 is that it's associated with your blood becoming hypercoagulable, which means your blood becomes very thick and clots easy, which can kind of plug up the kidneys. Now, if the infection gets really bad, a person can develop sepsis, which essentially means you get really sick, you have massive inflammation all over your body, and your blood pressure drops, which in turn hurts the kidneys. And lastly, there is concern out there that COVID-19 virus may directly hurt the kidneys. And they think this because some of these patients that come to the hospital develop protein and blood in the, in the urine, which is a sign of direct kidney filter damage. This situation is constantly evolving, which means evidence can change almost on a daily basis. My thought is we're gonna to have to look back a year or two from now when all the dust settles to truly know how COVID-19 has affected the kidneys and other organs. Also how those organs took time to recover. If you are someone that suffered COVID-19, please let me know your experience in the comment section. If you found this video helpful, please like and share it. And if you got something to say, leave comments in the comment section below. And remember, it's your kidneys, your health.